Hey there guys, I'm T. Marie. If you are thinking of living tiny, whether it's a tiny home or a trailer, I know a big question, a big thought is, what about the toilet? What about the bathroom? How do you do it? Where do you go? What happens with all that stuff? So that is today's topic. Now definitely comment below and let me know your concerns about this, your thoughts, your feelings, because I'll definitely do a video number two to address those issues. But for now, we'll talk about some basics so you know what to expect going forward. Let's talk toilet time. So the toilet is small and mighty. It has a cool little kind of seat indent at the top. A lid that actually curves over the edge. And it gets flushed with the foot pedal. There's a panel on the inside that lets you know when you have to empty the tank. Once it's time to empty your tank, you want to come outside and pull on the lever that's for the black tank. Then that's going to release the contents out of your tank through the sewage hose into the sewer system. This particular nozzle has a place where you can put a hose to shoot water back into the tank and help to rinse out after you've emptied. One thing we like to do is from the inside actually use our flex hose with a nozzle and wash this way. The flex hose is super awesome. It works and is compact. I'll leave a link to the flex hose and uh, nozzles down below. Once everything is all clean, rinsed and emptied, you definitely wanna use a drop-in. This is our preferred brand. I'll leave a link to that below. Just make sure you put one in every time. I just wanna give you this other tip right before we wrap up and that's tissue. If you are living in a tiny home or a trailer and you are planning on dumping the toilet tissue into your toilet, you will need to buy a specific kind. And that is because it breaks down easier than just your regular toilet tissue. We actually put the toilet tissue in a receptacle so we avoid it going into our tanks altogether. And that's so we don't have to pay a lot more for toilet tissue and so we don't have to go through the protocol of even worrying about toilet tissue messing our tank or clogging our tank up. Toilet time really isn't an issue at all. If you're nervous and scared about how this is all going to work out and if you're going to be able to make it happen, it's understandable. Tony and I both had that same feeling. I don't know about y'all, if you ever watched MTV Cribs or if you've camped with anybody, but there's a lot of people who are like no number two on the bus, no number two on the trailer. And so we had that like ingrained in our minds. And for the first few weeks, we literally avoided number two in our own bathroom. It was silly. And maybe this is TMI for you to know, but I'm sharing that with you because when we make big changes in our life, we think about things like this. And sometimes we just do dumb things like don't fully use our bathroom for weeks. But then eventually we're like, okay, this is what we're gonna do and that's just it and it's all good and it has been nothing but awesome. You know, you just learn the ropes and make it happen. So pretty much that's the lowdown. Hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe, comment, like, let me know what's going on for you. And um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.